Hello everybody. This is a series called Ask Stapleton. I don't know what other videos I'm going to do in this series. We'll figure that out, but we're at my little buddy's enclosure. There he is. Might be a little hard to see him. Yeah, might be getting a little scared. Okay. No, I just made him go in his hide. Oh, not fully. Oh, there he goes. Okay, so this question is, can reptiles get coronavirus? The reason this is a relevant question is, well, number one, coronavirus is spreading throughout the country. And number two, some animals have been known to get this virus. Whether you believe me or not, that's okay. Just ask Kevin Richardson of the Lion Whisperer. He'll tell you that some of his animals have gotten this disease. Uh, not as bad as humans. Although, yeah, one of his lions, when he got it, when that one lion got it, he wasn't doing so, so good. But, do reptiles and amphibians and inverts get this disease? Let's ask Stapleton. Stapleton. Buddy. Hi. Hey, um, hey buddy, uh, do you know if reptiles get coronavirus or not? They don't? Okay. Why don't they? Okay, I'll tell them. <laughs> yeah, that was, that was interesting right there. Um, okay, so yeah, reptiles, amphibians, and inverts cannot get this virus, virus, <laughs> but dogs, cats, lions, and other big cats can. And the reason why reptiles, amphibians, and inverts aren't affected is because this virus is only able to infect mammals. Now, the reason for that, I don't know. But according to Ethos Health, Health Vet, something like that, um, they say that no animal can get this virus. But that's plainly not true, as I just told you earlier. So, yeah. The reptile and amphibian and invert bodies are just not designed to carry this virus, whereas the mammal bodies are. So it's kind of like saying, oh, can the reptiles get the flu? No, but humans can. So it's kind of the same thing. But I just figured I would do a little video on this. Oh, by the way, uh, R.I.P. Ken Faust, who owned exotic pets in Las Vegas. For 20 years or more. It's a tragedy that person died. He was 61 years old. So he at least lived a decent amount of time. Still had some years in him. But um, his daughter said he died of a heart attack. Which is sad. And didn't know him personally. But he was one of the icons in the reptile community. And if you read the article about him on this one news site, it'll say he gave people pets that would not chirp, meow, or bark. So he was a breeder of snakes, lizards, frogs, turtles. Now, it's very sad that he died, and I'm wondering what's going to happen to that store because he does still have some people working for him. So I don't know if they have any contingency plans, but I hope they do because they had some great stuff that you could not find uh, on any other place or most, or like, there was maybe one other place that carried some things, but, you know, he probably carried some things that no other place had. I mean, this dude got a hold of so many great animals and... It's just sad that he has passed away. Ken Faust, 
He will be missed by the reptile community. That's for sure. Hope you're up in heaven, buddy. Well, I didn't know him, but I just like to say buddy. <laughs> okay, let's see Stapleton one last time, y'all. I don't know if you can see him. There. Oh, there's a tail. Yeah, he's... Okay. He's in the mood to hide. Say bye, Stapleton. Alright, right, guys. So, I hope you guys enjoyed that Ask Stapleton. Um... Very interesting video. Uh, I think I am going to do a Ask Stapleton on what diseases can reptiles get. Um, I'll, I'll think of some ideas. But, um, yeah, so this is a new series. Because, you know, the thing is, I really want to get more stuff with Stapleton. But the thing is... Like, I don't know what else to bring to you guys, so I figured the Ask Stapleton would be really cool. But hey, please check out some great animal YouTubers for me. The Lion Whisperer, the Myrtle Beach Safari, Venom Central, Viper Keeper, Venom Man 20. And I'll name off two more for you. Brian, Brian Barchak. And Olympus Reptiles. Go check all seven of those channels out. I was not being asked to shout them out. But if you love reptile content, you'll love them channels. And be sure to put some R.I.P. Ken Faust in the comments. By the way, uh, Ken is K-E-N, like the regular spelling of that. Faust, capital F-O-O-S-E. So put some... R.I.P. Ken Faust is in the comments there. So yeah, I just figured since we were talking about reptiles and he was a reptile dude, figured we would just discuss that. And he died recently, so it's still relevant. And I'm going to upload this video today. And great news, you guys. You guys have six uploads. And they're all snake feeding uh, videos. They're all part of like a mini series with snake feedings, of snake feedings, I mean. So be sure to look out for them six videos. Some of them are longer than others, but you guys will definitely enjoy tomorrow's videos. Peace out, you guys. Follow God. Oh, wait, yeah. Follow God, not the government. God bless y'all. Peace.